Hello everybody, I'm taking a quick look at an Audio-Technica Pro 70 lapel mic. This is not one of my own, this is one of my friends, and he wanted me to go ahead and take a you know look at it and see what I thought. I like the fact that the mic has a really nice little windscreen on it there. Looks like it's not stereo, like it's mono. I might be wrong on that, but I'll, I'll certainly check it and see. Uh, could very well be wrong, but this is, you know, you see what you have, you have an, a, a balanced... Uh, output there and so that requires you to have a, a cable like this and so there we have one of those with that you know special kind of end on it which is more of your high-end sort of connection becomes a little more unwieldy now what I'm recording this on right now is a very cheap Sony microphone a little stereo mic that goes into a, a Zoom H1 and I demoed that last week but this one you know, does not require you to, you know, the, the Zoom H1 configuration I have requires me to match this up with the audio on the camera uh, later in, in, in software. This one here will go directly into the camera and you've got a wire that connects you to the camera. So it looks to me like the uh, Audio Technica comes with this really, really nice feeling little bag there. I'm not sure what else is in there. Let's take a peep. Okay, that looks like it's some other uh, additional clip or something that could be used there to hold the mic, position it in some way. Looks like that would certainly fit on that. But so what I'm going to do, I'm going to test this. I'm going to clip that to my clothing here, and I'm going to I'm going to use it and see if it sounds you know, super far superior to what I'm getting with this uh, little eighteen twenty dollar Sony microphone and the Zoom H1. Like I said, what you get with this is you get convenience. You get uh, you don't have to go back and connect the audio or try to marry it to the video with software. It's straight on there from the get-go. So I'm going to certainly try that. And of course, I could do that with the small Sony mic that I have, only it just has a very short cable. I'd have to have a, uh, a cable extension for it, but I have an idea that this really probably will sound very nice. Okay, so I'm connected to the Audio Technica now, uh, the Pro 70. I'm trying to record. I'm not sure which mode, if I'm in the right mode or not. And so I have it positioned the same place I had the Sony microphone earlier. I'm going to switch to a different setting here on this, see if I'm getting anything at all. Okay, so now I'm, test I'm uh, connected to the Pro 70 Audio Technica. And I hope I had this thing turned on. I thought there might be a light or something on it, but I'm not seeing that. So maybe it's just a passive connector here or something. I'm not sure. I uh, kind of was expecting it to light up or be charged, but it could be this is some sort of a, maybe a lift or something here that this is, or something that is just a converter that lets you pick this up and it's more uh, dynamic rather than condenser. It has a button here that says push on it. So I'm gonna push the button. I don't know if that made any difference at all. Checking once again, I'm in this position here where it is the switch is all the way up. So let me go back to the middle position again. So there we are again. I'm going to hit the push push button again just to test it. Okay, and I just pushed that button again. And so here's the kind of audio I'm getting off the um, Audio Technica Pro 70. And this, of course, would clip to a belt or something. That would be hidden maybe behind the person and yeah it's certainly not anything that looks bad or anything like that and uh, of course i have it i guess a little bit sideways on me because of the sweater i'm wearing it's not hooked in vertically the uh small sony that i was testing before which is right here is more this kind of uh more this kind of thing right here you've got a a uh, i had a zoom h1 that i was running into and you got this kind of little deal. So I actually showed you last week what that sounded like. So hopefully I'm getting some audio here. We'll find out soon enough. The Audio-Technica Pro 70.